Hello and welcome. Today we're going to have a quick look uh, at the Office 365 Security and Compliance Center and to be precise at the alerts section. So what do we have here? Basically in the alerts section we can see a dashboard. This is an overview which has some web parts that uh, have different alerts. In my tenant, uh, fortunately, I don't have any specific alerts right now, but I'll show an example how it works. So when we actually check on view alerts, we will see specific active alerts. And of course, I don't have anything here yet. And then there is an option to uh, view different alert policies. And here, this is quite an interesting section because uh, you can actually see when the alerts happen. For example, if we look at the first policy, suspicious email sending patterns detected. Uh, let's say one of the users uh, is sending the account is uh, compromised and this user account is sending out a lot of emails to different uh, people to all contacts. Uh, of course, then uh, all admins will get an alert which says that uh, suspicious email sending pattern is detected. And then the admins can investigate deeper, can do the message trace or something like this to get to the, um, to actually check if the account is compromised or if, if it's a normal behavior. Another option uh, here is uh, e-discovery search started or exported. So when someone is uh, starting uh, an e-discovery search, then all global admins receive a notification which looks similar to this one. Um, it's uh, basically an alert that means that uh, someone has started uh, e-discovery search. So search for content of a specific user mailbox or something like this. And um, yes, based on this policy, this alert occurs. And if I click here on view alert details, then I see inside of my um, security and compliance center under alerts. Now, it, now it's visible, it becomes visible that uh, this alert is uh, detected with some details, the description, there is activity list and uh, things like that. And all tenant admins receive this notification. So if you have, it's a good practice to have more than one tenant admin um, to use at least four I principle that, you know, if, if some admin wants to run a hidden you discover a search or something, then the other admins uh, also get notified. Uh, yes, so this, as you can see, yeah, now this alert is visible here under view alerts and probably under dashboard. Yes, I see under dashboard also this uh, alert. Uh, and also there is an option to manage advanced alert. Uh, this section is related to Office 365 Cloud App Security. I'm not going to cover it in this specific video. We will go into it in uh, later in more detail. But just to give you a, a small teaser, if you click on this uh, uh, app security, then you see some uh, advanced alert configurations like for leaked credentials or uh, some uh, risky sign-in. Um, you know, so you, you, you can have a look through it, but uh, it's more advanced configuration. We will uh, do it a bit later. For the time being, the main thing to remember that this alert section, basically it allows you to view all security and compliance related events based on specific alert policies. You can create a different alert policies or you can use some of the default ones. Um, yes, so this is uh, this briefly covers our uh, alert section and um, we'll go into more details 
um, of other areas of the Security and Compliance Center in the next videos. Uh, thank you for watching. Have a wonderful day. Bye-bye.